Greetings in the wonderful name of our Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I am Bishop Matibani from Bethel Worship House. Welcome to Davidson TV. We're doing it ourselves. Uh, this is Men in God Pastor Series. I would like to talk about anger today. Anger, which is a poison, which is a problem that destroys societies, which is a problem that destroys marriages, which is, which is a problem that destroys working relationships which is a problem that destroys businesses because of people are angry at each other, are angry with one another and are angry at things that are happening around them and they are not able to manage the anger so that they will be able to help each other and move forward. When you read the Bible in the book of Ephesians chapter 4 verse 26, it reads thus, let not the sun go down on you while you are angry. There's importance of you not being able to go down Actually, it's important for you not to allow the sun to go down on you while you are angry because of you are losing a lot of things. You know, anger is like drinking poison yourself and expecting somebody else to die. When you are angry at someone who's not even aware that you are angry with them, it's like you are trying to kill somebody who does not even care whether they die or not. So your, your activity, whether it's good or bad, is pointless. But now, anger, it only consumes you, the person who is angry. It consumes you, it destroys you, it kills you, and it ends up causing diseases to you. What Jesus was clear, or the Bible is clear, when Jesus was angry at the church members who were busy selling at church, were, were conducting businesses at church, their church, they, they turned the church of God into a, a, a financial or social uh, a platform where they can socially make money. And when he got there, his anger was directed at the activity of what was happening around that place. Now, when you are angry with someone, just make sure that you don't allow the sun to go down on you while you are still angry. Be able to forgive. Allow forgiveness to lead you. Allow forgiveness to be the champion in your life. The more you forgive, you will see happiness endless. The more you forgive, you will see blessings endless. The more you forgive, you will see your life change because of you are attracting positive things in your life. You are attracting positive energies in your life. And not only that, but you are becoming the better person in your life. You are being able to see, to, to distinguish between bad and good. And when things are happening around you, you will be happy about it. And things will happen for the best, for the good. Because of anger is an empty emotion that only consumes 